Hey guys, welcome back. Star Wars has been a huge part of the lives of many people over the last few decades. The films are really great and have a lot of really cool moments. They also have a lot of pretty lame moments, but let's not talk about those right now. There have been some awesome lightsaber duels throughout the movies. Sometimes they're important to the story, sometimes the setting is awesome, and sometimes the fight itself is just plain sick. So let's get going. I'm Ron McKenzie LaFergie with Top 10 Nerd, and here are the Top 10 Star Wars lightsaber duels. Number 10, Mace Windu and the Jedi versus Chancellor Palpatine in The Revenge of the Sith. Okay, I'll be honest here, the beginning of this fight is so stupid. These are supposed to be highly trained Jedi and he just straight up stabs two of them in about five seconds. Like, seriously, what was the first guy even doing? That said, it was awesome to see Palpatine not only fight for himself, but use a lightsaber really effectively. Honesty time, the end of the fight is pretty bad too. For some reason, Palpatine uses his lightning attack and keeps using it until his face gets all messed up, which I don't really get. But his little spinny thing combined with the fact that you get to see Mace Windu wipe the floor with Palpatine made it a pretty sick fight. Number 9, Obi-Wan versus General Grievous in Revenge of the Sith. This is one duel that not a lot of people liked, saying it was unrealistic and stupid. And you know what? Probably was. But it was still cool. The guy had four lightsabers for crying out loud. How can a giant cyborg with four lightsabers fighting a Jedi not be awesome? Sure it's overt fan service, sure they're just trying to show off their effects, sure it doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but I defy you to watch that scene and not think whoa at least once because like whoa number eight Yoda versus Darth Sidious in Revenge of the Sith this is one of the most powerful battles in Star Wars between two incredibly strong force users while this fight does involve the two dueling with lightsabers that aspect is outshone when the pair begins playing catch with force lightning where you get to see just how powerful Yoda is it's no surprise that a duel between two of the most powerful beings in the galaxy would be awesome to watch and this fight did not disappoint well that's not true it was disappointing Disappointing that Yoda didn't kill him, but at the same time, we kind of all knew that Palpatine wouldn't die because, you know, that's how prequels work. Great fight though. Number 7, Rey versus Kylo Ren in Force Awakens. While certainly not the most technical fight, with Rey being super inexperienced with the lightsaber, it was a really impressive moment for her, and a super climactic part of the film. Plus that first moment where Rey calls the lightsaber to her and you hear Luke's theme swell, oh, I get goosebumps every time. Say what you will about Force Awakens, they really nailed a bunch of goosebump moments. The fight itself was pretty cool, tearing down trees and fighting through the destruction of the area, and had some pretty intense moments. You may say that Rey got too good too quickly, and I'll probably agree, but the fight was still pretty insane. Number 6, Obi-Wan versus Darth Vader in A New Hope. This duel is among the most iconic in all of Star Wars. While the battle itself wasn't the most epic, hampered somewhat by Alec Guinness's age and Darth Vader's armor, the story surrounding the battle and the subtle acting choices made by Guinness made this a fight you don't want to miss. The moment of recognition when Obi-Wan sees Vader and the iconic line, When we last met, I was but the learner. Now I am the master. It just set the stage beautifully. In the final moment of serenity when we see Obi-Wan just chilling, ready for death, it was just so great. Number 5, Yoda versus Count Dooku in Attack of the Clones. This one probably isn't a surprise to any of you. While Attack of the Clones was far from the most popular Star Wars film, the battle between Yoda and Count Dooku was one of the most redeeming scenes in the film. I remember watching for the first time and just being in awe of what Yoda was capable of. It was really the first time the audience got to see Yoda take physical action and engage in a lightsaber duel. And although we knew Yoda wouldn't die, it was really impressive and hilarious to see him jumping around like a flea. The only problem with this is it led to Yoda being a character in Soul Calibur 4 and he was just the bane of my existence. Despite that, however, this was one of the coolest duels in all of Star Wars. Number 4, Obi-Wan versus Darth Vader in Revenge of the Sith. This was one of the most intense fights ever, as long as you ignore Anakin's incredibly awkward lines. The setting is really cool with the lava and the fiery skies and it's a truly emotional moment for Obi-Wan. Even though I spent the whole fight yelling, just, just kill him, just kill him, the end seemed fitting given the characters. Plus, it was our first look at Anakin fighting as Darth Vader, which was pretty wicked. The battle itself was pretty cool too, but it's the circumstances surrounding it and the performance of Ewan McGregor that lands it such a high spot on this list. Number 3, Obi-Wan and Qui-Gon Jinn versus Darth Maul in The Phantom Menace. This fight was just so 
epic. It had emotional moments, cool moments, scary moments, and the actual swordplay was really sick. Probably because Ray Park, the guy who played Darth Maul, was actually a trained martial artist. This made a two versus one lightsaber duel look more realistic because you could really see his skill and athleticism. Plus it took place across a variety of really cool chambers, which was really impressive visually. And when Qui-Gon died, seven-year-old Ron was pretty heartbroken. Although seven-year-old Ron also thought Anakin was a cool character, so I wouldn't take any cues from him. However, even 25-year-old Ron will say that this was a really sick fight. Number two, Luke versus Darth Vader in Empire Strikes Back. Can you say classic fight scene? This scene is probably the most iconic in all of Star Wars, simply because of the end where you learn that Darth Vader is Luke's father. That's right, I didn't say spoilers. If you didn't know that by now, you deserve to have it spoiled. But just because the end steals the scene, it doesn't mean the rest of the duel wasn't intense. With sneak attacks, cool settings, and hands flying every which way, it's a really cool battle. I'll admit that some of Vader's lines are pretty cheesy, but those lines are eclipsed by the cool choreography and incredible ending that will forever be misquoted. No, I am your father. Number one, Luke versus Darth Vader in Return of the Jedi. It was so hard to pick which Luke versus Vader battle I liked more, so this decision came down to which one had cooler fighting. Here we see a more experienced Luke fighting against Darth Vader, with Luke eventually returning the favor from Empire and cutting off Vader's hand. It was a really intense scene with the Emperor watching and goading them on. It was really cool to see the interactions between Luke and Vader. Luke is not okay with hurting his father and tries to avoid fighting until Leia is threatened. And the two have a pretty sick battle. However, after Vader is defeated, Palpatine starts torturing Luke with some of the least realistic force lightning ever, leading Vader to see the error in his ways and turn against the Emperor, killing him. This fight was so emotional and had really nice bits of swordplay and led to a thrilling conclusion of the original trilogy. And the redemption of Darth Vader. I rewatched the scene while writing this and I was just covered in goosebumps. Guess it's time for a Star Wars marathon. That's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, do us a solid and hit that thumbs up button. And make sure to subscribe to Top 10 Nerd if you haven't already. Let me know your favorite Star Wars moment in the comment section down below. May the fourth be with you guys. Until next time, I'm Ron McKenzie LaFergie with Top 10 Nerd. Later, nerds.